Mary is trying new outfits for her wedding. The angel Gabriel was sent by God to a city of Galilee named Nazareth to a virgin betrothed to a man whose name was Joseph of the house of David. The virgin's name was Mary. And having come the angel said to her, Rejoice, you highly favored one, for the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women. But when she saw him, she was troubled at his saying and considered what manner of greeting this was. Then the angel said to her, Do not be afraid, Mary, for you have found favor with God. And behold, you will conceive in your womb and bring forth a son and shall call his name Jesus. He will be great and will be called the Son of the Most High. And the Lord God will give him the throne of his father David and he will reign over the house of Jacob forever and of his kingdom there shall be no end. Then Mary said to the angel, How can this be since I do not know a man? And the angel answered and said to her, the Holy Spirit will come upon you and the power of the highest will overshadow you. Therefore also that the Holy One who is to be born will be called the Son of God. Now indeed, Elizabeth, your relative, has also conceived a son in her old age and this is now the sixth month for her who was called barren. For with God, nothing will be impossible. Then Mary said, Behold, the maid servant of the Lord, let it be to me according to your word. And the angel departed from her. On the other hand, Joseph is puzzled and thinking how to break his engagement with Mary. Then Joseph, her husband, being a just man and not willing to make her a public example, was minded to put her away privately. But while he Hot on these things, behold, the angel of the Lord appeared unto him in a dream, saying, Joseph, thou son of David, fear not to take unto thee Mary thy wife, for that which is conceived in her is of the Holy Ghost. Then, then Joseph, being raised from sleep, did as the angel of the Lord had bidden him, and took unto him his wife. Mary, I'm coming! And it 
came to pass in those days that there went out a decree from Caesar Augustus that all the world should be taxed. Behold, behold, behold! There is a decree from King Herod for everyone. Go to your city and get yourself registered. Go! Go! Go everyone! Behold! 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 And behold! And while they were there, the time came for her baby to be born. Joseph, I can't walk now. I think the time has come. Okay, okay. Let me see if there's a room at the inn. Yes? Is there a room? Our baby is about to be delivered. <sighs> no, sorry. There's no place. Please. Uh, what to do? Okay, okay. There is a place, but it's a stable. Huh? It might help you. Come, Mary. We found a place. Okay. And in this way, Mary brought forth And in this way, Mary brought forth her firstborn son and wrapped him in swaddling clothes and laid him in a manger because there was no room for them in the inn. And in the same region, there There were shepherds. There were shepherds out in the field, keeping watch over their flock <laughs> by <laughs> night. <laughs> And an angel of the Lord appeared to them. And the glory of the Lord shone around them. And they were filled with great fear. And the angel said to them, Fear not, for behold, I bring you good news of great joy that will be for all the people. For unto you is born this day in the city of David a Savior who is Christ the Lord. And this will be a sign for you. You will find a baby wrapped in a swaddling clothes and lying in a manger. When the angel went away from them into heaven, the shepherds said to one another, Let us go over to Bethlehem and see this thing that has happened, which the Lord has made known to us. And off they went to find baby Jesus. Now, after Jesus was born in Bethlehem of Judea, in the days of Herod the king, behold, wise men from the east came to Jerusalem. Let me see. 
saying, Where is he who has been born King of the Jews? For we have seen his star in the east and have come to worship him. Let's, Let's see where, where the star, star leads us. us. Rejoiced with exceedingly great joy. When they had come into the house, they saw the young child Mary and Joseph and fell down and worshipped him. And when they had opened their treasures, they presented gifts to him, gold, frankincense, and myrrh. And they worshipped Jesus with exceeding great joy. Glory to God! Glory to God! Glory to God in the highest! Merry Christmas! 